Oh, finally today, 650 nativity sets. That is how many Father Roy Herberger has in his collection, and he's sharing about half of them this holiday season at Our Lady of Fatima Shrine in Lewiston. The display is part of the Shrine's Festival of Lights. I chatted with Father Roy, who is now retired, about how this collection came to be. He was first inspired by seeing a carved nativity scene from Africa at a conference. So that got me thinking, since Christ came for all people, how would people of different cultures say, what if he came not to Bethlehem, but to my village, or my hut, or my city? And what would the people look like? What would he look like? And so that's what got me started. And with each piece he's added, Father Roy said he's gained a greater appreciation of the Christian faith being without boundaries, something for all people, bringing a message of hope and love in whatever way they can. Come and see what people have done with newspapers, with Coca-Cola things, with uh, chunks of charcoal, with I have one set and each figure is a single grain of rice that's painted. If you can imagine. And the collection ranges from the humble to the humorous. One display that really gets people talking, the hipster nativity. The wise men rolling in on segways, delivering their Amazon gifts to the baby Jesus, while Joseph, with his man bun, takes a selfie. Father Roy hopes sharing his collection will bring some joy and some perspective to what is surely one of the more difficult Christmas seasons. And they're a sign for all of us in our families, no matter what we're going through. Be strong, have faith, never give up hope, and there will be better days. God is with you. And you can see Father Roy's 345 nativity sets, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, from now through the first weekend in January. The hours are 5 to 9 p.m. It is free, but you know what? They don't mind a donation because they are keeping the lights and the heat on and all that good stuff. They, of course, ask that you wear a mask, and the displays have been laid out so that everyone can remain socially distant and be safe. That is going to do it for Most Buffalo for today. Thanks so much for being here. I'm Kate Wellshofer. We will do it all again tomorrow. Until then, be well, stay well, and I'll see you next time.